Union says that a large percentage of officers working traffic outside of the concert tonight were being forced to do so rather than it being an optional opportunity for overtime. And that is causing a huge labor controversy between the city and police. A concert of this magnitude at Heinz Field requires weeks of planning for security and traffic details. But the Pittsburgh Police Union president says instead of Heinz Field paying city officers to work the Beyonce concert, the city instead forced 32 on duty officers to work traffic duty. 13 of them were pulled from zones during their shifts. The other 19 were kept late or called in early, forced to work overtime for the end of the concert. FOP President Robert Swartzwelder says the city shouldn't get to pick and choose which venues pay for officers to work these events, comparing this concert to Monday night's Penguins game. He claims the Pens hired 40 officers, paying them holiday pay, an average rate of $75 an hour. So for the Beyonce concert, Swartzwater calls this, quote, an outrageous use of public tax dollars. Chief Cameron McClay has said he will provide details of the expenses to city officials who will then decide whether to bill Heinz Field. Beyonce Beyonce's music video formation has stirred controversy, some viewing it as being anti-police. I feel like it's not more so anti-police, but more so empowerment for black people. I think it's all in perspective of how you look at it, and I really think that uh, Beyonce is a good woman, she does good charity work, and I, I think that she was taken out of context. The police union is not taking a position on Beyonce, rather saying being forced to work overtime is an unfair labor practice. They will file unfair labor practice complaints on behalf of all of those officers who were working outside tonight. Reporting live, I'm Kelly Brennan, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.